The Xiaomi Mi Notebook Pro seeks to be a worthy mid-ranger with a premium all-aluminum chassis, a good 2.5K 1610 display, and a decent spec sheet. So, welcome to our new product review episode. If you are new in our channel then please subscribe our channel and press bell icon for notification of our new videos. The Mi Notebook Pro features a unibody design made of aerospace grade series 6 aluminum that is CNC machined and anodized to give a premium look. The bottom panel is made of plastic, however. The hinges are sturdy enough and allow one finger opening of a lid. The lid does not wobble and there's negligible twist. The keyboard deck is quite rigid too, but it can flex a little when pushed down hard. Overall, the Mi Notebook Pro's construction leaves little room for complaint. The Mi Notebook Pro does not offer too many ports, but it does take care of the essentials. On the left, we find a USB 3.1 Gen 1 Type-C port, a HDMI 1.4 out, USB 3.2 Gen 1 Type-A, and Thunderbolt 4. Towards the right, we find the lone USB 2.0 Type-A port and a 3.5mm combo audio jack. All the Type-C interfaces on the device support USB power delivery, so there's no dedicated charging port available. Xiaomi includes a fingerprint sensor in the power button of the Mi Notebook Pro. The fingerprint sensor works with Windows Hello and is quite responsive in everyday use. A discrete TPM 2.0 module is present, which makes the device eligible for a Windows 11 upgrade. Our Mi Notebook Pro unit features a Panda LM140 GF1 LO214 inch 1610 panel with a 2560 by 1600 resolution, 300 nits brightness, and a 60 Hz refresh rate. The display quality is fine for general multimedia consumption and even for basic photo or video editing workflows. Anything more serious, may benefit from an external display with wider gamut coverage. The Core i7-11370H has a PL1 of 28W and a PL2 of 64W when plugged in. The 28W PL1 means that this processor can offer a base clock of 3 GHz and a maximum boost up to 4.8 GHz. The Mi Notebook Pro is the first laptop we've tested that features the YMT CPC005 Active NVM SSD, which made its debut in 2020. For those not in the know, YMTC is China's homegrown SSD maker with an in house developed 3D's tacking NAND. The Mi Notebook Pro's run times aren't particularly excellent, though they should be just about enough to get you through a normal workday. We measured about 8 hours and 12 minutes of backup in our standard Wi-Fi battery test at a brightness of 150CD-M2, which is decent. The Acer Swift 3 featuring the same processor and battery capacity offers significantly better backup, especially under stress. Any additional load will see battery life plummeting big time. The bundled power adapter can fully charge the laptop in about 1.5 hours. Thanks for watching this video. If you think this video is useful, then please give a like in this video and share with others. Bye for now.